Welcome to another episode of Leon Smash Burgers Pops In. I'm Leon Catalina and today's episode brings me 29 kilometers east of the Melbourne CBD in the suburb of Moronia. I'm turning dreams into reality. In the lab with the formula and chemistry. The memories spark and motivate and make the industry shake. We put the bars in the place. I'm talking one, yeah. It's one all on one shot, now the future is yours, go! For today's episode of Learn Smash Burgers Pops In, this restaurant is a true inspirational story of a mother and daughter duo from eating burgers to opening up their very own burger restaurant. Today, I pop in to Mum's Burger Kitchen. Let's go in. Mum, Rita and daughter Esther, owners of Mum's Burger Kitchen, opened their restaurant back in year 2015. They started the business from scratch, replacing an old Chinese restaurant. Mum managed a dollar store and Esther worked with the Crown before they opened Mum's Burger Kitchen. Both Rita and Esther had no kitchen or business experience at all. However, going to YOMG Burgers was the inspiration for it all, as they used to visit YOMG Burgers after work. And it all just happened from there. I had the absolute privilege to chat with Esther and get behind the kitchen to see how Mum's Burger Kitchens comes to life. Esther, can you please tell me what the inspiration and story is behind Mum's Burger Kitchen? The inspiration is probably, oh my goodness, I used to go there every single day. I worked at Steak Ministry, which is like right across the road, and every single day I would go get myself a Yomai with cheese. On the way home from, I had like a dream job interview at dinner by Heston, and I got the job. I was 21, I was stoked, and then um, she calls me on the way back. I'm like, Mom, I got the job, so excited, and she's like, oh, I'm actually at a shop in Bronia. Um, do you want to open a restaurant together? I was like, D you haven't worked a single day in a kitchen. Like, <laughs> are you sure this is a good you idea? You thought it was a joke or something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she's like, you've got a day to think about it. And I was like, oh my gosh. And I had to go back to the restaurant. I was like, I think I can do it all. Like, I'm not sure. And then in the end, I was like, whatever. It's me and mum. We're going to be the boss. Like, let's, let's see how this goes. You left in 2019 to work as a chef. Can you tell us about that? That was interesting couple of years. I worked at the Prince Dining Room in St Kilda. I was the brekkie chef there. The last piece in Mulgrave as well. It was mainly breakfast, but that I learned so much. Like just the basic things of how to scramble an egg properly, how to properly toast something. Like it seems super easy, but like, yeah, got so much inspiration. Like from different places. We had worked at a bagel store as well. Okay. Yeah, and then when we came back, kind of put the menu, I learned all around in here. And yeah, renovated the whole place. So that decision yeah. going off and doing that, the chef course and all that, and working mm. as a chef, yeah. that changed everything from Mum's Burger Kitchen. Fully, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so finally turning things around because we really started this business from absolutely nothing, so. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Your menu is stacked. It has beef, chicken, and even veggie options. What are the go-to burgers at Mum's Burger Kitchen? I'd say the Juicy Lucy is definitely the top seller. That um, it's actually an idea from my brother. Yeah. While he was in prison, he was watching oh. <laughs> Chef TV, and he was like, "You need to do this." And I was like, oh, "All right, sweet." Um, and yeah, it turned out to be one of our best sellers, so it's not all bad. Yeah. <laughs> Any other staples on a Mum's Burger Kitchen that you recommend? Simpson. The Simpson. Yeah, that one. It's like a mac and cheese patty maple bacon, beef cheese, caramelized onions, pickles, cheese sauce. It's just fat, right. yeah. <laughs> Is that after Simpsons in yeah. name? Yeah, all the burgers are named like weird. Pamela Anderson's like okay. the double patty one. <laughs> um, Simpson, because Simpson's yellow, so is macaroni. Oh, yeah. Yep. yeah, it's mainly for the staff to remember so it's easy when they're making it, they know okay. which one's which. All this burger talk is making me hungry. I think it's time for you to take us in the kitchen and show us how Mum's Burger Kitchen make their burgers. Let's get it. <laughs> Let's go. Cool. So this is where all the action happens. Yes. We got Esther. Is... We got Mum over there. <laughs> They're gonna show us how they do their burgers. All right, let's get it. So we'll start with the Juicy Lucy. This is the crowd favorite. Um, there's 
American cheese stuffed in the middle of it. So yeah, and we cook over charcoal. It adds that extra flavor. That's real charcoal. Yeah, I think this is our selling point. Um, so just chuck that on. And your custom made blend of meat? Yes. Secret. Pure chuck, nothing ah, pure else. Chuck, okay. Pure chuck, yeah. <laughs> and there's also some other stuff like mustard seed over there with some salt. Um, all of our bacon is maple bacon on every single burger. It's just. I can't it's believe you actually got. This is no secret, no hiding here. That's real charcoal. <laughs> this is flame grilled. Yeah, I'll chuck a bun on. And then there's fried jalapenos. So we just chuck a handful of those in and mix them around in our mix of flour and then into the deep fryer. All the burger joints now, they're on a flat top grill smashed. Yeah. They're on a flat top grill, but nothing like this. this is... No, no, this is... This mum's from um, North China where there's lamb kebabs cooked over coals and stuff. So that's where the inspiration sort of for the cooking yeah. style for the burgers. Yeah, fully. So now it's ready for a flip. And then some cheese. Bun should be toasted. Sweet. So all your ingredients, Esther, they're locally yeah. sourced. Yes. You have a local bakery. Yes. Your meat's from a local butcher. Right up the road. <laughs> so this one is a bit of spice, chipotle on the base, lettuce, and then bacon on the base. It's, it's very full. <laughs> Fried jalapenos. Tomato, salt, pepper, chipotle. Ooh. Nice and saucy. This one's dangerous for takeaway because you can see it's already starting to ooze out. <laughs> awesome. And that is the Juicy Lucy. <laughs> Next we have the Simpson on the grill. And then this one, the mac and cheese patty goes in. Um, the mac and cheese patty is stuffed with a little bowl of mozzarella inside, so when you bite into it, it's like um, So we microwave it for 30 seconds after just to make sure it's melted. And then we'll go with some cheese. So that's caramelized onions? Yep. Mac and cheese patty's done into the microwave. So this is the cheese sauce, Ooh. bacon, base, caramelized onions, patty and cheese, pickles, this guy, so if you open that, that's just <laughs> pure cheese, <laughs> salt, pepper, it's not our healthiest option. Cheese sauce. Homer Simpson is the inspiration for this one. <laughs> Mum has got the chicken. Mum reckons this one's better, so you can have that back. <laughs> Alright, uh, fried chicken. So do you usually use a chicken breast or a thigh? Um, for the fried chickens, we use a chicken breast, and yep. for the popcorn chicken, we use a chicken thigh. Alright, okay. I think she's good now. <laughs> Cheese and then into the Sally. Sweet. This one is the Andy, our classic fried chicken burger. Okay. Which the... character or in this world Andy represents this for? This is actually named after my ex-boyfriend who used to work here. Um, <laughs> Who, who helped us a lot, so shout out Andy, uh, yeah. who's a head chef at The Knot now. Okay. Um, yeah. So this <laughs> it's always a bit of an awkward story, this one. <laughs> and avo, and then lettuce. I like a lot of onion on this one. Okay. <laughs> Sweet. Sweet. And there's your fried chicken. Some slaw. Tomato. 
salt, pepper, and this is our sauce, mum's sauce, big, big uh, hit. <laughs> mama's secret sauce? Yep, mama's not so secret sauce. <laughs> Sweet. And that's the Andy. Esther, Rita, <laughs> thank you for letting our smash burgers hop in to Mum's Burger Kitchen. Thank you. Thank you. Woo. <laughs> Time to eat. Juicy Lucy, the Simpson, the Andy. All that juice from that cheese in the patty, unbelievable. Like crispy, crunchy, fried chicken. Mum's Burger Kitchen is a local destination for the suburb of Baronia. With a family and friendly vibe, it caters for all your burger needs and sides and truly has a warm home feel of a mum and daughter scene which makes everything even better. Baronia area is one lucky suburb and to everyone tuning in to Leon Smash Burgers Pops In, you have to do yourself a favour and check out the quality flavours on offer at this marvellous mother and daughter duo at Mum's Burger Kitchen. Open six days a week, Tuesday to Sunday from 11am to 9pm. Mum's Burger Kitchen is located at 5 forward slash 6 159 Baronia Road, Baronia Vic. Thanks for watching. Click and subscribe for the next episode. In the meantime, keep up to date on my social media for when Leon Smash Burgers pops up. Until then, see you next time.